Hi guys, today we're going to do a virtual walk around our fresh into stock Audi A6. It's the 2 litre diesel TDI and it's the ultra black edition. Finished in this gorgeous moonlight blue. As you can tell, a lovely paintwork. A really nice dark blue colour. Looks great. Going down to the alloys, we have the 20 inch twin spoke diamond cut alloys. Uh, which look absolutely great and go really nicely with the car. You've got your nice Audi centre casings on there too. If we go to the front, you have your Audi uh, LED headlights uh, with daytime running lights, really powerful and bright lights and they also look really nice as well with the car. You've got the nice uh, bumper with the black edition, so you've got the nice sport bumper. You've got the blacked out grills for the black edition as well and you also have the nice side bits as well and the lovely black splitter down there too, which is nice. Going on to the sides, you've got your S-Line badge in on the side, you've got matching coloured wing mirrors to the body colour of your indicators on there too, and black housing, and because it's the black edition you obviously have the black trims, uh, black B pillars and rear privacy glass which looks lovely. If we go to the rear, you have your nice alley rear tail lights which are bright and clear on the road. You also have your nice brake up coloured plastic diffuser on the bottom uh, with your two exhaust tips uh, in chrome as well which is lovely. If we go and open up the boot. You see you've got sweeping indicators. The boot also pops open when you press the button. Absolutely great boot space. You can fit loads in there. And you can also have your net in as well for some storage, which is nice. If we go into the rear of the car on the interior, you can see a nice S line uh, on the door cards there, on the uh, door trim, sorry. You also have the nice full leather interior. We do white contrast stitching going through which is really nice. These are really comfy seats and it's very spacious. You can fit three people in there nicely. You also have rear climate control with nice digital dials showing the temperature. You can also adjust uh, the fans as well. You also have a 12 volt charge in there as well. You have netting on the back of the seats for some more storage. If you go to the uh, door cards, you can see the Alcantara. You also have a bit of storage space there. You obviously got your automatic windows, your nice Bose sound system, the big speaker there and also up there. We go into the uh, driving seat of the same style leather seats but these have uh, a bit of lumbar support as well so very comfy and huggy seats these are also fully electric and the driver's seat is actually memory as well which is a lovely touch if we get into the car it's wireless gantry so put on the clutch press the stop start button the car will turn on and your media will pop out if we uh, go to the steering wheel you've got the audi s line flat bottom steering wheel full leather with the uh, stitching going through the inside as well to match your interior, which is lovely. We have uh, controls on either side, so with this side you've got your virtual driving dash display, so you can get your different uh, settings up, phone settings and radio settings, and also you've got your car settings too, which is lovely. You can change that and see what's going on. Uh, we also have your cruise control limiter located down here, which is really nice and accessible. You have your volume control and your voice command on this side as well. If we go down, you have fully electric automatic windows and you have your child lock buttons as well. We have your boot button located down here too. And obviously the Bose speakers as well for the black edition going out throughout the whole car, which is really nice. If we go over to the media display, control through your panels down here. Um, as you can see, you've got DAB, FM and AM radio, which is lovely to have. Um, so you've got internet radio. You can also connect your own phone through Bluetooth and USB to so listen to your own music. Um, if we go over to the telephone, you can see we've got the hands-free settings so you can speak through the car, answer calls through the car. Um, so that's really good to know how to pull over or be on your phone. If you put the car in reverse, you can see we've got front and rear parking sensors uh, with a nice digital display showing you their sensors as well and how close things are, which is really nice. If we go down, you've got dual zone climate control with your temperature as well, just the same as the back, uh, which is really nice to use. Uh, you can also change the recirculation of the car. Uh, with the air th and the, the aircon obviously. We do have heated seats on either side, uh, so that's great as well. And obviously you've got your CD player and your SD card ports as well. If we go down, you've got your automatic handbrake which is located there, so really nice and accessible out of the way, uh, really nice. You've got two drinks holders which you can actually slide away, uh, which is really nice. And then you've also got some more storage space here too, uh, which is great, you can also slide that away. So we open up the centre console, you have some more storage space and then you've obviously got your uh, 12 volt there too uh, for charging. So if you have any more questions about this car, please feel free to contact our sales team and potentially this could be your next new car. Cheers.